What's up, Palmetto Fishing? Today, this is my knife collection, and I'm just going to be showing you all my basic knives, and this is what all I have. And I'm going to start off with the smallest knife. This is just a little knife I've always had. It's, it's a browning, browning. browning knife, and it's very small, not even probably my like index inches. finger. That's probably about yeah, two about two inches. It's kind of hard to open because my hands are big bigger than the compared knife, compared to the knife Zip. and Tristan's gonna hold it I'm gonna hold it this was a really good carrying knife I'm gonna put it back yeah. and this one is just my brother's I bought it for him it's yeah. a Ozark trail knife we gotta but Ozark we wanna trail have, ain't that good but but mm. this one what we're gonna try and do we're gonna try and do like we customizing to, things because we, we need to tighten, tighten them we're gonna have to tighten this because if you see it's, it's very loose. It's very loose, know. and then when you close it, it's not lined up at all. Matter of fact, I cut my hand on a knife the other yesterday. I'm about to cut you. Right there. Then I got another Ozark Trail one. This is this, this one's, one's not really as nice. bad. I had this one for a while. It's it's kind of messy now. Really, it's messy now. Cause it's we it's bad. older. Yeah, it's old. But yeah. This one has done me very good. I forgot what this is called. But it's a good knife. I like the see. grip on it. I don't see. I don't see the brand. Opens up good. Closes. And yeah, I like the blade on it. I mean, it's sharp. But I have one rust on the blade. You haven't had any problems out of that knife. Now, this knife is heavy. It's metal. I'm going to start carrying this one. It's very heavy. It's metal. It don't have a, a thing like this knife does, or the other ones like I have. The, um, but this one is so heavy, you can't do that. Well, do that. You, you can really, like you can do that if you're strong enough, but you really got to give it kick like like that. Cause it's got a kick to it when you. I like the black and the gray on it, but the thing about this right here is the whole side, like this piece inside of it. It's like the whole side you gotta push in, cause it's heavy. Yeah, I like this knife. Oh yeah, this knife does have it. I forgot about that. It does have it. It's sharp too. This knife I like the best. I forgot what it's called. But I like the opening, how you can open it, and the blade's so big. Yeah, I like the blade on that knife. It's a really. I like that, the pocket clip. That's a really good like carrying knife. Yeah, I carry this one. Protection. Knife. Matter okay. of fact, we had to use this the other day because my brother ordered something and FedEx got stuck in our yard. And my yeah. dad, we okay. had to get him out. Only FedEx. This knife, this is my favorite knife out of my whole collection. It's a Filipino grip, and I like the pocket on the pocket clip on it. And it's really a normal pocket clip. But yeah, it's a normal one, and it's a Filipino grip. And the folding pin on the back, you push it, and it comes straight up. That's the thing I like about it. Instead of slinging your arm all over the place and opening it, like this one. So yeah, like this that one, one. You really have to kick. You have to get kick it. And it's really hard to close, really. And this one's a really good knife. I'm gonna start carrying that one. But this one I love the most because you can just pop it right up. But. Out of the second knives I like the best, ooh, the second knives I like the best is this one. Well, the third one I like the best is this one right here. I like the grip on it. It's great. Uh, I just like how you can <laughs> do it like this. Oh, yeah. I can do it like this, too. My dad told me that. Uh, I really like the blade on this and the... Uh, I think I forgot what a nail flip. I, th I, think, I forgot what it's called. But I, I just like the wooden on it. It's not that hard to close and open, really. And then the next knife I'm going to show you guys is these right here. Well, no, I want to show you this. It's a, a Gerber. Gerber. This is like a, it's a Gator Gerber. It's like a really weird. It's a good knife, but like, I, it's rusted. If I didn't know it was a Gerber, I wouldn't have, uh... Alright, we had some technical difficulties, but we had to fix the lighting a little bit better. Um... Yeah. 
so back to the Gator Gerber. This knife is a good knife, but I've used it, and I've never known it was a Gerber until I found the case to it. It's a knife. 1996 knife. So Gerber 650. I'll be right back. It's a very cool knife. Nice grip on it. Easy to carry around when you're hunting and stuff. And to close it, there's a little pin about thick as the blade. You push it in. Well, it's kind of hard. Push it in. That will come up. Close the blade. Then put. I'm gonna put it back in the case. Um. The second knife I want to show you guys is this one. It's a UTS knife. It it came with a sharpener on it with the case. And see, I didn't like the, uh, I didn't really like the, um, yeah, we have two more knives to show These are you. our dads. These are our dads. I'm um, sure them in I didn't know, I didn't really like the thing on here that came, the orange. I we hate really gotta, it. But we I really gotta it. fix so the leather. We'll have to fix the leather up on it. But I Show got on. some leather, and I fixed the leather on it. But we'll fix it up a little bit more because it really doesn't look that great right now. Show them the leather because they really can't see it. Right there. Yeah. Shredded, and then blade. It's about a three to four inch blade. Two to three. I don't know. That maybe six, maybe. Maybe two to three. No, that's about four or five. Four or five. Five yeah. or six, five or six. I just like how I made it, cause I didn't, I did not like the orange on it. It did, it just didn't make, it just made the knife stand out, and I, I just like, I don't know. But this is my dad's folding knife. He's got, there's two blades on there. Let's see it real quick. It's a. Uh, we usually, he usually uses this when we go fishing sometimes. Well, he really doesn't carry it. He at don't care. He, he used carries to. this one all the time. I'm gonna show him this one. Second blade on here. Ooh. Don't cut yourself. And that's what his uh knife looks like. Alright, I'm gonna show you Ooh, that's pretty short. His other knife. We really did not find that until it was in but one, I found it a one video days. we're gonna do our uh, gun collection video. I'm gonna do it. Alright, this, this is, is my his dad. other knife. This is where he carries. He carries this because it on the this is like say this is your hip. This is this will stay on the inside of your hip or like on instead your belly of, instead of being it on like instead straight of down. like this knife. You see how you can just go right through and it'll be straight he down. Likes this one will be sideways. Goes open sides. So this it, will go sideways. Because when you this have a customized. Because when you have a thing like this, it pokes in your. Uh, yeah, he don't like it when he's. So this, no. this is a really nice. This is a. I think you can get it for like twenty dollars. on... So uncle. I don't know what it is. I'll, oh, I know, I know. It's, it's a charade. A, no, it's a Uncle Henry charade knife. You can get this off of Uncle Henry for like I think it was like twenty. Cause I looked it up. I was about to order me one. It's like twenty. My dad actually cut his hand on this cutting an oyster on the beach. Yeah, that's how sharp it is. But that's nice that knife. And this uh, one is a I right. This is a right edge. Yeah. I don't know. I think you got this as like a flea market or something. All right, All right guys. Let's show, let's this show is, them that one last. This is my old timer. All, right. All right. I bought this a, a few weeks ago, I think. A few months ago. Yeah, a few no. weeks ago. Yeah, it was like it was a week like, ago. No, it was like three days after Christmas. And y'all will be seeing this on New Year's Day. Well, this is when we're out later on New Year's Day. It came with this case in the box. And I, I don't know, but I like this one, how it's like this. Straight down. Straight down. Just because how the knife's made. I'm buttoning it. I'm telling you guys, I'm going to use this for, like, when we go rabbit hunting and stuff. It's a charade, and it says... Old timer. Old timer right this there. This is really, really sharp. It's so sharp. It looks like a little kitchen kitchen knife, how the buttons are on the end. But I like how it's made, how the blade is right here. But, yeah, I like that knife, That's too. And, uh, I don't really let nobody hold my knives, because I'm afraid they're going to... Them break up. them or mess them up because yeah. I really love my knives and the last ones I want to show y'all this is my buck knives both of them and I'm telling y'all this knife they're sharp don't even take the thing off of it off the blade he's got that rubber this is the, the small one there's two yeah you like that. it's sharp it's kind of I don't really like this one because it's hard to put in but I like this uh big buck knife 
He's not carrying either. I'm of these. not carrying these. I promise you guys. I am not carrying these unless we're going hunting or something. I wouldn't even I wouldn't carry them when you go carry hunting. It. Just carry like your camouflage ones when you go hunting. Mm, that's tough because it's new. This is it. It's kind of big. It's about about that in my hand. And fold it open. Serrated blade. It's about a three to two inch blade. Good grip. Now I'm going to show y'all one thing on this knife that I love. A low pocket clip. Low rider pocket clip. That's like the best. That's the best uh, knife Tucker's ever owned. He was going to buy a Spartico. I don't know what it was, but I, I just love this knife. I'm getting a Ruger knife for my birthday. Oh, I'm a... I'm I have a... Pistol. I have a trainer butter knife, butterfly knife coming. Oh in, yes, so yes. we're gonna have to do a. Vi we're gonna have to do a. Uh, I already know some tricks to do with them. I've that's already gonna be good. Do video with. It's in. It was in. Oh. All right. That was it for the video. We will have more like individual videos for each knife. Stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. See y'all next time.